Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to G9's Taco Truck. It is the morning of day 14. I've got a couple of skill points to spend here this morning. The first one is going to go into Mother Load. And the next one into Robotics Inventor Level 1. That will increase the damage that our Sledge Turret does and also pump up the stats on a Shooting Junkie if we ever decide to use one of those. Now, first thing we have to do this morning is get wood because that's the sensible thing to do in the morning, especially when you have none and you need to make more spikes. Let's take a cruise towards the southern end of this city. One, because it hasn't been explored yet. And two, I'm thinking like on the outer skirts we'll find a Bob's Boar, so I'm hoping that anyway, because we are completely out of food. So uh, Bob's Boar's would be great to raid, at least to just kill all the pigs inside. Well, we gotta raid this little passing gas, because we're still on the lookout for a crucible, and this might just be the place to find it. See if we can pick this ATM first. Oh, almost a thousand bucks, leaving us with only one lock pick left. It was worth it, I guess. All right, uh, how do we get in this place? Through the back, I'm assuming. Oh yeah, this is the one with the underground bunker. Okay, can get through here real quick. Check out the main stash. See if back up, lady. See if we can find a crucible, and then, uh, either way, we'll find some good loot. And we'll get the fuck out of here and continue our search for either a Bob's Boars or another passing gas or a working stiff tools would be a good place. I mean, I feel like a working stiff tools would be our best shot at finding one, but you never know. I've found one in the trash before. Hey, lady, are you lost? Wandered into the wrong fucking place, that's for sure. Oh, there goes your leg. I can take off the other one, call you Lieutenant Dan from now on. How you feel about that? Oh shit, you're still alive, you sneaky prick. These zombies, they're good at playing dead. Scrap the nail, scrap the lead, and let's get down here now. Got some trash in this room, and that's it. More lead. Let's get in here now. I'm sure we got some zombies. That looks like Big Mama right there. What? There we go. Down he goes. Chill, buddy. Oh, this poor guy just can't hold himself together. All right. Let's see what we got. Another weighted head mod. Can't really use that. Cornmeal, I'll take it. Fuck, get me alive last night. Oh, let's see. Give me a crucible, please. Food. Can't be mad about that. And the hunter mod. We'll put that in the crossbow. Give us a little extra damage against animals. Oh, they found us. Being underground doesn't make you safe. Murky water. Take uh, all that stuff. Nothing there. All right. Let's uh, do this thing. Reloaded. Nope. What about the shotgun? One round. 
All right. Now we're ready. Oh, clip, big boy. Damn. Back up. Shit. Oh, you like that move? That's called the Jersey Scramble. Oh, I think that did it. Yeah, see what happens when you back me into a corner, you fucks? Let's get out of here. Oh, let's do that a few more times and we'll be good. Almost forgot about this again. I need to grab some steel. Even if it's just 10, 12 pieces. So we can do a little bit of repair work on the hatches tonight as we fight the horde. Ah, oh, the high school is one smash and grab I could never pass up. Well, almost never. You do have to break a couple of cobblestone blocks to get to it, but it'll be worth it probably. Got a crawler to deal with, and we have uh, another zombie approaching from behind. Biker. Down he goes. Boom, all right. I made a hatch to put here. Huh. It won't, it won't go in the doorway for some reason. That's okay. It'll do just fine right here. That biker woke up. Everyone else is sleeping, though. Let's wake someone else up. There we go. Got a radiated and a biker. Pop this up. Big boy's up. And there go all the bones in his legs. How are you still alive, big boy? Your femur should have gone through your brain once you hit the floor. All right, see, that was not so bad. And look at all this loot. Nice. Hey, ten more lockpicks and time charges, so we certainly won't have any more trouble getting into safes today. Come on, poke your head out. Beautiful. Well, we really don't got to worry about Bob's boars anymore. I think I'll go get that supply drop, and then we'll just keep exploring, and we can do what we want at this point. Sell the seed recipe. Nail gun is nice. Let's check this car. You never know. Could be a crucible inside. Nope, just one spring. There's a chicken. No, oh, get out of here, you ugly fucking bird. He's just mad because I don't harvest him anymore. Fuck him and his rotten flesh. No, oh, god damn it, Skinny Pete. Can't you see I'm hunting over here? Well, let's make a quick run through this place. There's some passing gas crates in the back and another crate up on the roof. Repair kits and oil shale. More repair kits and oil shale and I guess that's it. Shit, I thought there were three crates in here. Whatever. Let's just go get the one on the roof, and uh, we'll keep it moving. Lucky looter book. Find more ammo in loot. That's a good one. Probably the best one. Well, if we're not going to find the crucible, we might as well get more ammo and shit. Oh, we're waking him up in here. No. Oh, I thought someone was in there. Two of them, and I'm out of stamina. There's a bird out there too, but fuck him. He can't come in here. This is a people store. Here we are. 
We're gonna break into the gunsmith after this too. There's a bunch more loot in there. Nice. I thought we were gonna have to go get the time charges. Food. Find more food and loot. That's another good one. Shit, we're running out of room here. This is where the good shit is. Just break in through this door here. This office should be clear. Yeah, we got a zombie on the other side of the fence there, but I'm not too worried about him. And we got Big Mama. Oh, level 5 side by side. I mean, at least it's a firearm. I would much rather a pump. You know, I mean, I I don't know. I, I, I thought they were supposed to add in some sort of slider where you can adjust the kind of loot that you found. Maybe that got delayed to Alpha 21. I know a bunch of Alpha 21 news has, has come out recently, but I really haven't looked into it. I'm I'm just waiting. You know me. I don't need to know all the fucking details. Just when it's ready, give it to me, and I will play it. Well, level 4 side by side. I guess we'll sell the level 3 that we have. I'll hold on to that level 5 and the level 4. So, I, you know, I could put two in my tool belt. That's four shotgun rounds before I have to reload. Here we go. Magnum book. Do 10% more damage with 44 guns. Now we just need one. Super corn seed recipe, some acid, another side-by-side -side shotgun, level 3 this time. I guess this is fucking double barrel day. Um, let me, scra I'll scrap those. I always make more of those in the forge. We probably should run out to the mini bike, though. Another Magnum book with a 44 gun drawn in combat. If you use 20% less stamina. There's another crate in this truck here. Let's grab that and then we'll head home because we still have to uh, get the spikes set up outside of the taco truck. That's on the other side of the fence. Not a big deal. Well, at least we got real food to eat tonight. I'm not shoving 25 pieces of cornmeal down my throat. Here we go. Board number 14 in the taco truck. Let's go, bitches. Fucking special tonight is double barreled shotguns and flaming bottles of alcohol.
And I believe that is it. Pretty easy night. Junkie went down pretty fast. I think it might have been the Molotovs, or maybe the zombies that were trying to get to the front door were, were beating on him, I don't know. But usually the sludge turret lasts all night. This thing went down pretty fucking early. So if it was the Molotovs, maybe I should refrain from using them. The pipe bombs didn't seem to do any damage to the sledge turret. Um, so we should see about getting our hands on some more pipe bombs. Those, those work well. Well, I guess that's it. All right, another easy night. Not much repair work to do. And it's probably going to remain that way until cops and demolishers start showing up. But by that time, hopefully this place will be steel. We should also work on maxing out robotics inventors so we can use two junk turrets, a sledge turret by the door and a shooting junkie up on the roof. And I think we'll be pretty fucking good. When we get to that point. Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you're looking forward to seeing more. Thank you so much for watching and all of the support. It really does mean a lot. You guys can follow me on Instagram or Twitter. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more Glock9's Taco Truck, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.